often cited as Dickens' first convincing female character, Estella is a supremely ironic creation, one who darkly undermines the notion of romantic love and serves as a bitter criticism against the class system in which she is mired. Raised from the age of three by Miss Havisham to torment men and break their hearts, Estella wins Pip's deepest love by practicing deliberate cruelty. Unlike the warm, winsome, kind heroine of a traditional love story, Estella is called cynical and manipulative. Though she represents Pip's first longed-for ideal of life among the upper classes, Estella is actually even lower born than Pip. This Pip learns near the end of the novel. She is the daughter of Magwitch, the coarse convict, and thus springs from a very lowest level of society. Ironically, life among the upper classes does not represent salvation for Estella. Instead, she is victimized twice by her adopted class. Rather than being raised by Magwitch, a man of great inner nobility, she is raised by Miss Havisham, who destroys her ability to express emotion and interact normally with the world. And rather than marrying the kind-hearted commoner Pip, Estella marries the cruel nobleman Drummle, who treats her harshly and makes her life miserable for many years. In this way, Dickens uses Estella's life to reinforce the idea that one's happiness and well-being are not deeply connected to one's social position. Had Estella been poor, she might have been substantially better off. Despite her cold behavior and the damaging influences in her life, Dickens nevertheless ensures that Estella is still a sympathetic character. By giving the reader a sense of her inner struggle to discover and act on her own feelings rather than on the embossed motives of her upbringing, Dickens gives the reader a glimpse of Estella's inner life, which helps to explain what Pip might love about her. Estella does not seem to be able to stop herself from hurting Pip, but she also seems not to want to hurt him. She repeatedly warns him that she has no heart and seems to urge him as strongly as she can to find happiness by leaving her behind. Finally, Estella's long, painful marriage to Drummel causes her to develop along the same lines as Pip. That is, she learns through experience to rely on and trust her inner feelings. In the final scene of the novel, she has become her own woman for the first time in the book. As she says to Pip, caught, Suffering has been stronger than all other teaching. I have been bent and broken, but I hope into a better shape. Uncaught.